looking for a mini projector for small spaces or to take anywhere? Let's check out this one from AAXA today. Hi, this is David of Tech for Baba, a channel I share my experiences on how technology enhances my time with kids and family as a dad. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please consider subscribing to the channel. In today's video, let's unbox and check out the AAXA P400 Short Throw Mini Projector. See how well it works and what makes it special. Special thanks to AAXA for sending this out for me to try and share with you. The P400 comes in a solid box printed with a lot of information of the projector. Inside the box, there's a nice company card inviting positive reviews and negative feedback. Very good. A detailed user guide in English. Under the foam, there's the P400 projector. Very small indeed. It comes with a power supply. A remote with many functions. And how thoughtful, a little tripod. Let's look at the projector in more detail. It has a plastic shell, all black. It's shaped like a small rectangular box, about 4.5 inches by 4 inches, and just 2 and a quarter inches thick. Weights about 1 and a quarter pounds. It's compact and very portable. What's cool is the P400 has an internal 39 watt battery, which can run the projector for about 2 hours. Just enough to watch most movies. On the top, there's a subtle AXA logo. And in the center, there is the touch control keypad. There are buttons for menu, navigation, OK, back, and volume up and down. In the front of the projector, there's a lens with LCOS technology and a 30,000 hour LED inside. This is a native 1080p projector and it's well labeled as such. Also in the front, I can see the built-in speaker. We'll check out how it sounds later. There is also a smaller AXA logo in the corner. On the left, there is an USB -A port and a couple of fans. On the back, there is a micro SD card slot, an indicator light, model number and another logo, this time in white. On the right side, there is the on and off button, power input, a little reset button, a HDMI port, a wheel for manual focus adjustment, and lastly, a headphone jack. On the bottom, there are four rubber feet and a quarter inch screw for the tripod. Now let's turn it on and see how it works. Here I just have it mounted on my tripod and pointed at a wall in our bedroom. The projector boots up quickly. What makes this projector special is it's a short throw projector with a 0.7 throw ratio. So we can get a bigger screen from a shorter distance. The screen is about 100 inches. And the projector is just about 63 inches from the wall. The focus needs to be adjusted manually with this wheel on the side. There is no keystone adjustments either, so it will need to be placed at the right angle and height to the wall. I can hear the fans, and they are about 47 decibels from 6 inches away. On the screen menu, there are apps to play video, photo, and music stored on a plugged in USB device or micro SD card. But here I have it connected to my brand new M2 MacBook Air through this USB-C to HDMI dongle. By the way, I'll be sharing my thoughts on this M2 MacBook Air soon, so subscribe to the channel and come back to see that video. Let's play one of my latest videos on the DJI Are Mini 3 Pro. Are you a fire like me? If so, I think the new DJI Mini 3 Pro is the drone for most of us. Hi, this is David of Tech for Bob. Not bad. Everything looks great on a bigger screen. Let's try some music to see how the built-in speaker sounds. It 
Let me know what you think in the comment section below. It's okay for such a small projector, but for better sound, I connected the projector to a better external speaker or a headphone through the headphone jack. In addition to a laptop or a media player like the Roku, I can also connect a game console like the Switch to the projector for some big screen gaming. Now at 400 LED lumens, it's not a bright projector. When I turn on the light in the other room, the display becomes a bit harder to see with less contrast. But it's sufficient for a dark room. AXA has brighter models like the P6X and the M7. They're a bit bigger and more expensive. I hope to get one of those to share with you, so subscribe to the channel and come back for that video. For about 270 US dollars, the P400 is an affordable compact projector that's easy to take anywhere. There are further discounts from time to time in the link I'll put in the description below. What makes the P400 special is it's a short throw projector, so I don't need to put it as far back from the wall to get a big picture. It has a built-in battery so it can be placed more freely anywhere in the room. Great for small rooms and when we travel. Thanks for watching. If you find any part of this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share this video with your friends. Have you found a good small projector? I'd love to know which one in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos on how technology can enhance our life with kids and family, please subscribe and turn on the bell to be notified when I put out my next video. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, remember to cherish each moment.